It is Monday and I have a Skype interview at nine in the morning today. So I am up and ready and ready to get this thing done and excited to see what happens afterwards. So yeah, nine in the morning because the person I'm interviewing with is overseas and in a different time zone and I have no idea what time it is where they are. But it's not nine in the morning, but it is here. So I had to wake up earlier than I normally do because I wanted to get ready and like do a bunch of prep work before everything went down. computer set up ready hoping that my internet stays decent during this entire call because I live in an apartment and sometimes my internet sucks so hopefully that doesn't happen but yeah I'm excited a technical screen over Skype I've never done it over Skype before so we'll see how that goes so just a few like minor technical difficulties when it comes to setting up Skype today this morning I don't know why but Skype was acting really funny on my computer um, and didn't want to load because it wanted to be I don't know, authenticated in some weird way. Anyways, we have it set up, worked through that, and we're now five minutes out from when I'm supposed to be contacted by the interviewer. And this is my least favorite time of interview days, is that anticipation to either get called back into the room because you got there a little bit early, or the anticipation to get that phone call or Skype call because it's just a lot. And you're so ready to like just spout out knowledge and you've prepped for it and then you just have to wait. And so I'm waiting. So we just finished up the interview. It was scheduled for about 30 minutes. It went 15, 20 minutes. It went really well. Um, I answered some of the questions that he had before he even got to them based upon answers for other questions, which is always a good thing to kind of be able to show knowledge quicker than what they think that they may need to lead you down a path. Yeah, it went really well. I'm super excited for the next steps. Hopefully I hear back something very soon. I'm obviously going to keep you guys updated. But for now, it's Monday and it's time to be productive on my own stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and get to work on that. And I will check in with you guys in a little bit. So we're a little bit later in the afternoon now. It's about 3.30 and I'm getting ready to go to the gym so I changed my clothes which brought up a point that I wanted to make about phone interviews or online interviews, things like that. They come in all different like shapes and sizes when it comes to phone screens, right? I've seen the gamut of them between the 15 minute like HR check-in just to make sure that like you're the type of person that's going to be okay being invited into the office. Like it's really just kind of like a personality check type of thing to like really in depth, like online code interviews where you're like coding on a shared screen with another person who's at a different location and you're online and talking through a webcam. Like I've seen the whole kind of gamut of those things. One thing that I would suggest to do is something that I picked up when I was in college and the philosophy is stated dress well, test well. So like, while this isn't a test, I still kind of believe in this philosophy where like this morning I could have just rolled out of bed and like had my cup of coffee and stayed in my pajamas and like done this uh, phone screen and no one would have known what I was wearing or anything like that. But instead I woke up and I got showered and I got clean and I put on decent clothes, like clothes that I felt comfortable in, but like clothes that I would go out in the world in. So I put on jeans and like that polo. It just made me feel a little bit more comfortable and like a little bit more productive and a little bit more professional, even if it's just subconsciously, like I could carry myself a little bit better knowing that I wasn't like just bumming it out and like hadn't showered in 24 hours or whatever it was. It's a philosophy that I used in college. Like I said, if I had a test, I maybe, you know, actually put in some effort into how I looked that day because it accomplished something early on in the day to then accomplish something during that test. And it's a strategy that I've used for phone interviews for a long time and I think that it works for me it may not work for everybody um, and like I wouldn't put on like a button down and like tuck it in and like wear slacks and wear like Oxford shoes or whatever if you're not comfortable in that you want to be comfortable putting in a little bit of effort can sometimes help make you carry yourself better even over the phone they say that if you smile while you're talking on the phone that comes across even though the person can't see you just smiling alone like lets them know that you're happy because you carry yourself in a different way when you're smiling it's kind of the same concept only with like how you're dressing yourself and how you like appear even though they can't even see you. So there's that and now I'm off to the gym. I will check in with you guys when I get back. 
back from the gym now and some really exciting things have happened today. I had that phone interview this morning and I've heard back some feedback from it already that it went really well and just kind of waiting to hear next steps from some of the higher ups in the company. So that's super exciting and hopefully I'll have like really good solid news sometime before Thanksgiving. That would be the dream. As far as this video, I'm gonna cut it off here. I have to cook dinner at some point today and other than that, I'm just chilling. So Leo has come to say hi. I don't know if you can see him, maybe his tail will get in the edge of the picture here. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. If you haven't already, feel free to hit that like button on this video because they are super awesome and they make me smile. If you haven't already subscribed, that button's down there. You know how to click it. I will see you again very soon. Bye.